Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Let me, let me quickly reset my camera. Oh, it's kind of the same quality. <laughs> but uh, welcome back. Good uh, good morning or where, wherever, you, wherever you are. Uh, good afternoon. Um, and in this video, we'll talk about Bonk again. This is your daily update. Uh, yesterday, we talked about it. Yesterday, the price was uh, still very much, uh, well, not necessarily higher. And I also, I always analyze it on the one hour. Uh, but yesterday the price was right here at around uh, well 21,000 and what we said then they said it, it was quite likely that we would fall and in general that uh, that yesterday we talked about the possibility of, of setting up some sort of a consolidation right uh, because the EMAs were, were practically flat here in the middle which means that if the EMAs are flat the average price at least on the short term is usually the same so that means it's, it's moving sideways the, the, the price um, so, so we talked about the possibility of, of consolidating here uh, between 25,000 and uh, 17,500, which is a support level we hit uh, a couple of hours ago, uh, which would be good. A consolidation here would be a, a bullish market structure because a consolidation in relatively bullish market circumstances usually um, means a bullish breakout. But what's happening right now is that a consolidation looks less and less likely. Um, Bitcoin in general, I mean, Bitcoin right now is, is quite bullish, right? I mean, Bitcoin right now is, is doing fine <laughs> this morning, at least. But overall, it's pretty choppy and it's having ne negative effects on Bonk, right? Bonk is quite bearish when Bitcoin is bearish and it's not as bullish when Bitcoin is bullish. Um, as far as it's correlated, which is not even that much. But you also see some sort of a cycling going on, right? So right now, uh, meme coins on other chains, for example, uh, uh, on Avalanche with Kokinu, uh, are doing better uh, has got up about 55 percent so there is that cycle people who made who made a lot of money with bonk are looking for other meme coins from other chains to invest in uh, and if you look at the technicals that's what i think right i mean that's not the truth but if you look at the technicals right here if i can type uh, what you'll see is that the volume um the volume and the open interest is still decreasing all right so that means that we are losing momentum and the one thing that Bonk right now needs to break out of this downtrend, because I do think this has, has turned into a downtrend, I think that's objective too. I mean, look at this. Um, we need momentum. All right. So for now, I have to be bearish on Bonk. I, I don't want to be. I mean, I've always been bullish on Bonk uh, until the Binance listing. And so, for, well, no, I'm not going to say it. Um, but no, until the Binance listing, because the Binance listing, a, a Binance listing for a, a, a super bullish crypto and usually meme coins. Usually that means the end, um, historically, all right? It, this is practically the same as what happened with Pepe. Pepe did get another rally. So I think another rally, not as high, but just bullish momentum. So I think that's possible for, for Bonk as well, but it's not right now, all right? So I do think Bonk will rally again, but but not from not at this moment, all right? The, we just broke below the 200 EMA right here. Uh, 17,500 is still a strong support level, but given the fact that the market structure obviously is bearish, uh, we're still losing momentum here. Um, it's still mo it, it is most likely right now, I think, that we'll get a bearish breakout. So that Bonk breaks down below 17,500, retests this level potentially, but then drops down towards this next support level around 15,000. And then from there, we'll see again. I mean, like I said, at some point of time, uh, Bonk is going to find some support and the market circumstances will be good enough that we can actually get a bullish breakout and, and potentially get a rally of like 30, 50 percent, something like that. So that's a possibility, but I uh, I don't think that's a possibility right now. Right now, I think it's more likely we'll, we'll drop down lower. Uh, so be careful. All right. Be careful trading Bonk. Wait for the right moment. Wait for wait for some bullish confirmations and then you can potentially enter again. But for now, I'd say it's not a possibility. It could change over the course of today, but I, I doubt it. Uh, but I, uh, I'll keep you updated on that. For now, these are my thoughts on Bonk. Um, thank you for watching. Don't forget to check out my, my premium and signal group down in the description or the pinned comments. Uh, but that's uh, completely up to you, of course. Uh, for now, thank you for watching. Take care and bye.